two in the books, facing a very, very good Lou Fuse team. Um, young team, but really trying to find their way, an excellent coach that they have over there. Um, so we're just kind of trying to hone in, um, focus on our fundamentals and, and continue to grow. Um, a lot of things that we need to work on and improve um, and get better as we're going to be facing a very, very tough schedule the rest of the way. Um, and just looking forward to putting in the hard work um, and, and, and kind of pushing through this season and, and getting better each and every day. Run them over, get out the way. Yeah, hello. Yeah, Pablo. Pablo. Damn, stop the feet. They're stopping your feet. You're waiting on the contact. You gotta run through the tackle. Run through the tackle. Go through your feet. You gotta move your feet. That ball high and tight. Stay low. I'm gonna get a missed shoulder and keep my head up. You're knocking yourself out the fucking game, and you're taking your vision away. Because if you run them over, now you got to rebound and see where the fuck you at. Keep your head up. Come on, next one. Good. Ball high and tight. All right. Get your head out the mix. Get out of one big area I really, really feel that we need to take a step in is, is our offensive line play. Um, really feel like if we can can take the next step and, 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 and get better in our offensive line play, then our whole team um, dynamic is going to just go to the next level. Um, being able to identify who we're supposed to block um, and really, really firing off, we really need to be able to to have that be, be in our DNA as far as the offensive line goes. Um, Coach Chris Taylor has done a phenomenal job um, in getting these guys to this point, but really, really counting on him to help help our offensive linemen go to the next level. And he's he's definitely the guy to be able to do that. Chris Taylor, I coach O-line, D-line. Uh, St. Louis, Missouri, went to Rosary High School, a.k.a. Trinity. That's right, state champs, baby. Uh, went to school, started at LU, and then transferred to Central Matthew sat back out here. I actually like seeing kids smiles on their faces. And it's just, hey, it's fun. It's the funnest time of the year for me. That's the only sport I love, Coach. Jones made the tackle. And 
the Rams have won the Super Bowl. No line. The game is over. The game is over. And they know who this guy is for a good damn reason. He used to play for the St. Louis Rams. He used to play for the Oakland Raiders. And he made the Super Bowl winning tackle in the 1999 Super Bowl. Yeah, y'all wouldn't even thought of. But, but, but this man played at a high level, and I wanted him to come out and talk to you guys. So clap, clap it up, for Mike Jones. Hey guys, hey, I uh, appreciate you guys allowing me to talk to you for a few minutes. Again, Coach Brooks, as you said, and I'm, this is how old I am. I coached him in high school. I tell you, I'm an old man. But uh, I coached Coach Brooks in high school. Uh, I'm Brooks from Kansas City, from the University of Missouri. I played running back in the University of Missouri. Uh, I thought I was a good running back, but the NFL didn't think I was very good, so I didn't get drafted. I went to the Raiders and had to learn how to play linebacker. So I played linebacker with the Raiders for six years. I came here to San Louis and played four years with San Louis Rams. In my last few years, I played with the Pittsburgh Steelers. The reason why I'm telling you that little bit good about my background, when I was in high school, I had a guy that was a talented guy, rushed for a thousand yards in six games, averaged 30 points a game in basketball. And you guys may have heard of a guy by the name of Bo Jackson. He was drafted in baseball behind him. So this guy was extremely talented, but he didn't take care of himself in the classroom. And he didn't get any scholarships. Listen to your coaches. I'm say it again. Listen to your coaches. They will make you better people and better players. Work hard. There's a couple things I tell our kids that takes no talent. Be on time. Work hard. And be tough. That take you to be very fast to be those three, those three, three, three things. Make sure, like I said, do those three things that don't can take any talent. You're going to see a lot of guys that have more talent than you, but you're going to be better than them because you are working, you're tougher than them, and you're smarter than them. And you're on time. This is a team sport. This isn't an individual sport. I don't care how great of a running back you are. If you don't have anyone blocking for you, 10 guys are going to tackle. How great of a quarterback you are. If your wife shoes don't catch the ball, you're just throwing incomplete passes. So everyone in here in football, greatest team sport ever because it takes every person on the team to do what they're supposed to for success. There's no other sport that you can do that. Baseball, you can be a great pitcher like everybody else. Basketball, you've seen LeBron James and them guys. He takes the ball, he can score every point. In football, you need everyone because in order for us to be successful as individuals, you got to do what you think. This is the biggest thing, though, that, that I want you guys to take away. Coach didn't play running back in the NFL. He played linebacker. All right, put your hand down. He played linebacker. So some of you guys play a position right now. That doesn't mean that you're necessarily going to play that position when you get to high school, college, or anything. So that's why we train you to play everything, right? 
because you never know what genetics are going to do and what you're going to play. But also, you guys got to be students first. You got to be students. And if you're not a student, you're wasting your time. You got to get the grades. The student comes before the athlete because it's a direct reflection when you're not doing what you're supposed to do at school and you come out here to practice and you don't do what you're supposed to do, we already know that because they're direct reflections of each other. You understand? Yes, sir. You understand? Yes, sir. Clap it up for Coach Jones. Obviously, our kids don't know who Coach Jones is, um, and they've never seen him play. Maybe one or two kids, you know, have seen old highlights of him making the tackle, but very, very fortunate for Coach Jones, and we appreciate Coach Jones for coming out um, and taking an opportunity to come speak to our kids. Um, as many men that have, have had as many accomplishments, accomplishments as he has, uh, we definitely want them around our program to be able to influence, you know, so uh, we really, really appreciate Coach Jones for taking the time to be able to come speak to our boys. position you know what I'm saying so we can we can because it's gonna be played it, they didn't even get the ball but if they do something wrong we can go ahead and correct it so so it don't affect us down the line that's the biggest thing let's get it what we need and let's get it bring it in bring it on three bring it on me <laughs> <Bullet. laughs> I, I thought he said brothers he said bullet oh, you wrong hey bro. win on three win on me Mason, one two go. three win. Win. Right. new fuse won the toss and the first you want the ball don't you Matthew Dickey, where we see players, you tell your team that you're going to receive, you tell your team you're kicking. For that, the king, the power, the glory, forever and ever. Amen. Amen. Hey, 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 do I need to say anything? Yes, sir. Do I need to say anything? Yes, sir. Bulldogs on three, family on six. One, two, three. Four, five, six. Family. Kick return. Kick return. We were just like, come on, get it. Set the tone. Watch the ball. Let's go, Jack. The cat. We outside, baby. Hey, good job, Miles. 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 Hey, the bootleg you coming! That east and west. Hey, the bootleg coming! Stay outside! Go! 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 
Tiempo, tiempo. Big dogs in the house! Big dogs in the house! He hurt. He hurt. All right? Because this is it's sensitive when someone's hurt. All right? This game is violent. So when somebody gets hurt, we don't just say that. You got to take a knee. All right? And make sure they're okay. You don't want to get paid, man. Get his hands off you. Coach, don't teach you nothing. Hey, man. I did. Boy, get him boy. You hey, gotta go, man. Finish the game. Do you understand? Yes, sir. Do you understand? Yes, sir. No more mistakes. The first half, every play, somebody made a mistake. We have to play mistake free football this second half. Do you understand? Yes, sir. Kick off team. Let's go, team. Let's go. Let's go. Bring it in. Hey, let's live it up. Let's go. Come on. Go. Hey, bang on three. Bang on me. One, two, three. Bang. Let's go. Good job, Jaquari! Good job, Jaquari! Good hit, Cam! Let's go, Cam! Great job! Let's go, Cam! Good job, Cam! Good job, Cam! Good job, Hey, look, Dan, you better go down there and hey, hit somebody. I need somebody. all new D linemen. Josiah, Steven. Come on, y'all grab the ball. He don't got no mouth. I'll be there. Hey, Tay. 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 Hey, You gotta go! You gotta go! You gotta go! Hey, with the guys in the center, you go run away! Kick off return! Kick off return!
One person in every play made a mistake. We need 11 people doing the same thing every single play. Do you understand? One class. If one person makes a mistake, two clap a touchdown. Some guys are getting an opportunity to play, and then they get in the game, and they're not doing what they're supposed to do. We have to make sure we are doing our job. Do you understand? Yes, sir. Again, good game. Got another tough one. Next week, we have to prepare. We have to prepare. We need 11 men doing what they're supposed to do every single play. No excuses. No excuses. Do y'all understand? Yes, sir! Up. Hey, it starts your practice, fellas. Bulldogs on three, family on six. One, two, three. Bulldogs! Four, five, six. Family! Family.